Hello there, long time no see you, my little kids. Welcome back to my stories with the alphabet of Cleo. The alphabet of Cleo is here for you to make you wonder about magical words full of creatures and animals. Mm, are you ready for this story? It's a blue, blue, let's dive. Let's dive with our ducks deep, deep into the ocean. The story we are about to learn and read today, it's, watch, it's called School of Fish. School of Fish. You can see here, you have a different kind of fish. Ah, this like, like looks like um, uh, Michelangelo, I see Alecino fish. Uh, sea snake, sea star, starfish, uh, swordfish, and this is a pretty cute fish. I have no idea. It's a, I don't know. This is a seahorse, this is a shark, and here we have, here we have, I don't know which fish is this. Can you tell me? You have some rocks, some seaweeds, and a pearl, an oyster showing up a pearl. Also, this fish with a barracuda fish. Mm. Let's move. It's seven thirty seven three zero seven. What number is this? One, two, three, four, five, six, and seven. Seven. It's seven thirty under underwater. It's seven thirty, my my friends, my kids, and the school is opening, open, open and shut, open and shut. The school is opening. They are going to school. You can see the here. There is a school signal. Mm -hmm. School is written here. School. They are going to school. All the fish, one by one. Here, here, there. Hey, hey. Come here, my friends. But no, there is a trap. Am I? There is a traffic in the sea. There's a traffic in the sea, a noise. Flagman help out. So we have an octopus, a squid, a squid fish. This crustaceous is not a fish. And we have a crab, another crustaceous. Yeah. It's a crab, a king crab. Who give the way, who tell the way to the students. First subject, first room. How to sail a boat or a ship? A boat or a ship? Some students, some students, yeah. Find, find teacher salmon a bit too boring. Teacher salmon is, yeah. It's a salmon, it's a teacher salmon. Oh, it's so cute and it's pinky, pinky, pinky skin. And it's a suit. And uh, the shark finds the lesson a bit boring, right? How the lesson is a science lesson. Science. How to sail a boat or a ship? Here we have a showing degrees, some information about how to sail the boat. They are underwater. Don't forget. Then, my friends, we have a history lesson. History, history, history of the seas sky and stars history of science this history lesson goes slightly better with teacher siren and her clips you can call her siren or mermaid is more famous than the american one mermaid but i like it called siren the classical greek name so is your teacher siren hmm? mrs siren some students have questions like see the his seahorse I have a question, please. Teacher me, um, 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 teacher me, I have a question. Why the sun is so bright, like these lights behind me? Why the sun is so bright? Ask the seahorse. Hmm. Uh, are there any fish in the sky? At uh, least it's about the sea, the, the, the sea sky, the, the, the sky outside, uh, out of the water. Are any fish in the sky? Asked the starfish. Mm. The starfish is here. 
Teacher, teacher, are uh, there any fish in the sky? Teacher knows. After teacher Siren answered the, the many question, I showed how the moon, the moon is here, the moon, the moon, um, pulls, 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 do you remember Peter the Postman pulls the sea per, and cause high tides hmm? because the moon you see is causing these are like high tides, the water the moon pulls the water up up, up, up so the water, the tides of the sea goes up it's time for lunch break it's time for a lunch, are you ready? Let's see the lunch room or the canteen. This is our whale room, our whale room. You see the whale here. So their canteen, their conservatory room, their lunch room is made out of a big whale, oceanic whale. Students enjoy their meals you can see here uh, meal drinking the meal let's pass me the salt please pass me the salt someone is the salt maybe this fish mm, it's the stuffy goldfish milk for me this um radish fish got the milk more fish sauce needed here more fish sauce maybe the shark needs more fish sauce mum tom I love spicy food, says the snake. So we suppose he got a bit chili sauce in his sandwich. Yummy, yummy, says the, uh, maybe the starfish or someone else. Okay, they are in the whale room. I can't see the text here. <laughs> Look at the whale, there's a very, very serene expression, peaceful expression as she swims swims the whale swim pretty fast can swim too in a deep ocean let's see next subject and next lesson ready oh, oh, oh we have a teacher doing some some waiting some lifting lastly students have their favorite lesson what's their favorite lesson p e repeat with me p e daddy i had p e mommy I had PE this morning. Tomorrow I have PE. I will be happy. PE stands for like funk. Physical e education. Physical education. PE. P lesson. Because you do a physical efforts, exercise, and it's a kind it's a part of educational system, right? So you learn how to move your body and you learn how to educate yourself with your body mm. with a stomach full full they can enjoy my stomach is digesting too <laughs> my stomach is full too you can see I'm trying to burp I refuse my burping from outside the air comes out so i stop it students with their stomach full can enjoy the workout with teacher octopus so this teacher here is uh, is the family of octopus okay in fact he has six arms and they should have many many ten tentacles tentacles look at the shark look at this uh, the goldfish look at the seahorse how they lift the weight Look at them, how they, uh, they lift or uh, pull weights around the class. The class is always underwater. So we cannot breathe there, but they can breathe. They are fish. Hmm? They have uh, fish scales and uh, also, also it's cold, it's cold. Anyway, they have some uh, sleeps to let the oxygen comes in and comes out. Their organs are different. But you don't need to know the you do what you have to know. Fish can breathe gels underwater. They can breathe underwater, but we cannot. So we and you close your mouth. Are you closing your mouth? Tap your mouth. Shut. Maybe you need a stick so it comes out. Mm, oxygen stick. Now we move to, we are, the lesson is over. 
we got science, science of sailing. Then we got history of the sea lesson, science lesson, history lesson. Then we got a break with the lunchroom. And then the last subject was, number four was, uh, 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 P, P, E, uh, yeah, yeah, P, P, yeah, P, P, P. It's time now to go back home. Ring, ring the bell. So Ron and his room ring the bells. The bell rings. Ring, ring, ring. Oh, in a Vietnamese school, you have a bong, 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 bong. School time's over. School time is over. It's time to go home. And we see their parents going home. This is supposed to be the mother of the swordfish. Swordfish too, of course. Same species. The seahorse mom, the, sa the snake father, father snake, sea snake, uh, mommy shark, that's a mommy shark. And this is a father or mother. I think it is mommy. Mommy looks like mommy to me. That's a mommy goldfish, mommy root fish, and mommy sea stars and some seaweeds. I'm shaking, I'm shaping the, the backdrop. It's over. School time is over. It's over, guys. So it is the, the story over. Let's find out. No, no, no. Here on the water and there in your house, school time never ends. Why? After some games and relax, uh, after some nap time, it's time to, oh no, it's time to study, study and study, study again, school time never ends, especially in China and Vietnam, there are too, 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 too many exercises to be done, too many homeworks, look at this, uh, she, there's this snake, as uh, the father as tutor, the father is teaching him. Hmm? He got a special teacher, is his father, helping him to do some degrees, uh, some ge geometry, uh, trigonometry, not yet geometry problems, triangle, uh, making some uh, 30 degrees, 90 degrees, uh, corners, uh, angles, angles. Then we have the seahorse here, uh, got the father also as teacher, maybe he studying literature. Then we have Mommy Shark, we didn't see before. Oh, Mommy Shark changed color, she got pink now. <laughs> then Mommy Shark, so that was Daddy Shark. He's teaching maths. Uh, also, maths has been taught by sea, has been taught to the sea, the starfish, by, by the, I suppose, as a hattie, this can be the Mommy, sea starfish, or the Daddy. And uh, instead, we have a private tutor mm, as a jellyfish. Mr. Jellyfish is the tutor of the goldfish, so he needs private tuition. As often you see in Vietnam, you have always private tuition, private tutor. And uh, the fish got the private tutor too. Study, 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 because you need to learn more and more. Bye bye with joy. Hope you enjoyed my story. So the story is over. But for the books older, for the one who purchased the book or got the book for free, by uh, by the course uh, for whoever wants to learn more and let the kids learn more about vocabulary we have treated uh, the, the vocabulary we in regards of the vocabulary used in the story we have learning this learning section learning with mom and dad don't delay further always take my time when i speak important words starting with letter s these words you found already in the story so look up and look back for them okay when i mention them you can go and look for it the first is nouns is school school s c h o o l underwater we have a school of fish school 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 then we have the c c you can see is ee -E, and this is the sea also the water the ocean look look school and sea then we have students students or oh, student one hoxin um la hoxin like i see students students or oh, student then we have subject subject with final t sound dental sound subject School, C, students, C, 
subject then we have sky letter y sky i forgot to say sky in a minute time now bien is the c stars sao the stars then we have salmon salmon cow 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 ra cow something casa salmon i forgot how to say in a minute ca something salmon cow va cow da something like that with ma then we have something i'm mispronouncing the story mrs mrs the teacher is is called siren siren mm, interchangeable with mermaid you might know mermaid i teach you you now siren i prefer to call siren the, the, from from which from 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 this noun comes the sounds of the police siren starfish or the ambulance starfish i'm talking about fish we have a starfish then we have the seahorse 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 then we have baby shark to shark don't forget the k sound from the letter k as we have a letter k in a snake snake then we have stomach stomach that is not so much is stomach and then we have letter S S S sauce double S sauce sauce fish sauce hot sauce chili sauce mayo sauce they are all sauce red so tomato sauce so, so double S first and the end the end then as a verb we have sail 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 the boat sail the ship sail the sea study hop hop study study it's not learn it's study study we don't know if you learn and show show them them show then we have the adjectives uh some very important i want some cheese some some i would like some ice cream some snack some is an adjective or quantity quantity okay school see students go to look for it all the fish are students in this story they study with their classes then we have subject uh, subjects we have science maths vietnamese english japanese uh, and well, music and whatsoever sky stars salmon fish siren starfish seahorse shark snake stomach sauce sail study and show it's time to show you the story and some bye bye hope you enjoyed learning with mom and dad with joy as well